Hey, it's me, GV, and welcome to another Shrine Guide for The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Ladies and gentlemen, this one is going to be the Joku Usen Shrine, which has been the most difficult shrine to get to out of all of the shrines. My gosh, uh, if you don't know how to get to this one, I would say just keep playing the game. Eventually, you will figure it out, uh, and I'll leave it at that. I don't want to spoil anything. This one is a nightmare to get to. However, the actual shrine itself is none other than approving grounds, which means all of your equipment is stripped away. I mean, you should know this at this point if you reach the shrine. And you have to utilize what's in the shrine itself in order to succeed. So uh, we will go ahead and do that. And I'll show you where the shrine is. Joku Usen Shrine, Proving Grounds, Short Circuit, way down here. This is actually the final sky shrine that I need to get. That's I have all the other ones. So that's going to feel good. Uh, let's do it. So we're going to start off by grabbing this. I'm always going to check and see if I can take pictures of the stuff. Uh, and then what we want to do is go around and corral all of the stuff that they're going to give us for this particular shrine. So, there are some shock fruits here, uh, which we can fuse to make a, little, uh, make a little thunder spear sort of thing. Which, let's go ahead and test that out on this dude right here. Come on, come on. So you can see you want to use the shock fruit, like, to hit somebody at first. I'm going to take that arrow, thank you. Uh, we're going to fuse this again, if we can. There we go, we did some decent damage. Okay, let's try to take this guy out here. I'm going to throw this now. Beautiful. I'm going to take the old wooden shield. I'm going to take the wooden stick out here. And let's go ahead and try to grab some more stuff. So we got some constructs up there. And they're sitting on some metal things. I think that's to... That's so that you can, like, use electricity on the metal platforms that they're on. But we're going to come up here and fuse with the shock emitter. So that's going to be the big one. And then uh, we can also go up here. I'm just going to grab this, but we can ascend here in order to grab a topaz, which you can use electrical attacks with as well. But we're just going to go for this guy. Okay, good. That's going to kill him, and we're going to grab his arrows while we're moving constantly. Beautiful. All right, let's go for this guy now. We're going to try to sneak strike if we can. They don't ever want me to sneak strike. Okay, you can have this. How's your health doing? Okay, you are dead. We're going to grab you. We're also going to grab this shock fruit over here. And we're going to grab anything sparkling on the ground because we could definitely utilize that, including all these arrows and bows. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, got to watch out here. These guys are scary. Okay, good damage. Uh, didn't want to do that much there. All right, we're going to kill this guy here. You drop the shock emitter club. Let's grab that again. Oh, not good. You drop the old... Yeah, they're making me drop all my stuff because we're getting shocked. Um, obviously, the more health and stamina you have for this one is going to be the better, obviously, as well. Okay, we got too many dudes at once here. Uh, okay, let's see. Let's see... So if we can just get one hit off, we'll do massive damage like that. Okay. Gotta go for his little friend here. There we go. There we go. Now we can lay into this dude. Okay, we're gonna pick up everything now. Including this. And there should be just one more Zonai construct left. The question is, where is he? He's right there. So yeah, you can... Um, I wonder if you could throw this to shock it? Oh, you totally can. Cool. Yeah, so that's why they're on the metal platforms, so you can shock the metal platforms and shock them on it. Your equipment will be returned to you. Thank you very much. So not too difficult of a shrine. Uh, just got to keep in mind that you want to use those shock emitter clubs, obviously, for your benefit. And where the topaz is and where the shock fruit is. And mainly just where the shock emitter is. That's the main one, uh, which is up here that you want to fuse with. We're going to go ahead and grab our chest, which is going to be none other than an Electro Elixir, which is definitely appropriate. And finally, I have completed this shrine. God, it was so difficult getting to this shrine. But thanks so much for watching. If you found this helpful slash entertaining, consider leaving a like and a comment. Consider subscribing with the bell turned on. We'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.